I found these at Ace Hardware today and I am going to do a little unboxing and testing and review of myself totally unpaid promote um, this is a totally unpaid review of these home pro quickie smart clean they were ten dollars at Ace Hardware it's a microfiber cloth multi-pack so I'm gonna do a review of these and tell you what I think of them here's a look at the back of the box a cloth for every household cleaning need Here's kind of the instructions, no bleach, no fabric softener, wash on warm, dry on low, soaking does not remove all the dust and dirt, machine wash. Each cloth included in this kit was especially formulated for the unique cleaning needs of the different areas in your home. And it says smart, clean, quickie. So I will let you know what I think of them. You can kind of see the different textures. Let's break them out of the box. Let's get these out of the box. So it was taped shut or rolled up. how big this is. It's got a little tag here that says quickie kitchen and bathroom microfiber cloth. So it's labeled, which will be nice. I'll be able to remember which is which. It's a good size. I mean, that's a pretty good size cloth. And you can see the, the texture of it there. It's really soft. No, still got the tape on it. Thought I pulled that all the way off. Oh well, get that in a minute. Okay. On to the next. This is the stainless steel one. Again, it's taped. Ooh, this one's really soft. Okay, and it has the tag. Stainless steel microfiber cloth. You can see this side and if you look the two sides look different whereas this one the two sides pretty much identical this one the two sides are totally different feel and texture so that's the stainless steel one and here is the blue one, which was the window one. And again, it has the tag labeling it, which is really nice. And again, these are really big cloths. I mean, there's my hand. That's a big cloth. Here's a look at both sides so you can kind of see the texture on them. So there's that one. Oh, there it is. And here's the last one. And this one was the dusting cloth. Untape it. And there's our tag. Dusting and polishing microfiber cloth. Again, it's quite a big rag. These are really good sized. And then here's the, the two sides so you can get a look at the texturing on those. So we'll see how they do over the next few days when I use them around my house. And I'll let you know. There they are. Here I have the green kitchen cloth. And you can see right here on my stove I have like this stuff that's been caked on forever. So I'm going to take the green cloth and let's see if... And it might be doing something. I mean, we got a little 
spot coming up there. And there's a little color there where I was rubbing. So maybe it is doing something. I mean, it got something up. So far, I'm not overly amazed. I'm still scrubbing pretty good here. Okay, I have the Quickie Smart Clean cleaning cloths here. And I have the silver stainless steel one, the green kitchen one, and the blue window glass one. I have my glass cooktop. The stainless steel one claims, let's see here, where is it? The stainless steel one says it restores luster and shine. The kitchen one says it scrubs surfaces clean. And the glass and window one says it cleans glass windows and plasma streams, making smooth surfaces sparkle. Which one cleans the bathroom? So I have my adorable helper Wyatt here. He's five years old. Or Yeah, you're five. He's almost six. And we have my dirty kitchen stove. This is actually freshly cleaned, but you can see it has these caked on rings around the glass cooktop. So we're going to let Wyatt show us. Which rag are you going to start with? This one. The green one. So the green one says it's our kitchen cleaning rag. So try to get that black off, Wyatt. Right here. Scrub on that. See, it's starting to come off. You think it's coming off? Okay, let's try the window one on those black spots. Not working. Yeah, it's not really working, is it? And let's try the gray one. Alright, let's try the gray one that says it's the polished stainless steel. And let's see, I'll try the blue one up here. Mine's, it's, mine's starting to get off. See, mine's getting it off. I don't feel like it's really changing much. Me! I, mine is working. I mean, I'd have to compare footage, but... Mama, look. I'm scrubbing pretty good, and I don't feel like that's really... Look at me. Look at mine. Look at mine over here. Changed a whole lot. Mom, look at mine. Mine's starting to change. Is that? Yeah. This one is working. Gray winds. Gray winds. No, we should test the bath, the bathroom. We should test the bathroom. I mean, it definitely makes my cooktop shine. I mean, look at that reflection on there. But it's not getting. Let's all use all three the of them. At, no, let's use all three of them at a time. I mean, it's definitely polishing and shining. I mean, look, you can see the reflection of the, of that down here on it after I use the window one. So it's definitely, you can see the reflection of the clock. Now we should go test the bathroom. So, so it's definitely polishing and shining, but it's not getting that black off. So, dirty is still out. Okay, here you can see all these fingerprints and dirt and everything in the TV. But me. This is from Little Boys. Nope, that's, this is the window one. Oh. So we have our blue window oh, cloth gotcha. and our cute assistant. And he is going to wash the TV with the blue window cloth. Look how that's doing to it. Look what's doing to it. It's yeah, it's kind of Leave and you see all the smears now? Okay. Here, let's see. It's starting to look better. It's starting to look better. Hey, what you've got? Well, how does that look? No, let's see if it doesn't Well, it's definitely better as far as the fingerprints go. 
But there we have all these smears. No, I still see a lot over here. That I'm thinking maybe the stainless steel one will. No, maybe you're supposed to do it with the cloth tray. The box doesn't tell us. I'm not super impressed. Okay, this is right here. This is actually a whiteboard that we now have our art display on. But you can see right here the kids whiteboard when they were using the whiteboard the markers went off the, the edge so let's see i've tried scrubbing this with everything under the sun and it hasn't come off i've even tried magic erasers 409 and a deep scrubby it's taking some effort but it is lightening it up so i think with some some good scrubbing. This might actually be able to get my wall back to white finally. Howdy! We're in the bathroom and I've got the the blue glass and window one. And you can see all these smudges. Can you see them in the mirror? So it's definitely doing something. All right, here we have, this is frosted glass. This is soap crayon I'm scrubbing off right now. The boys love to color with soap crayons in here. But can you kind of see that soap scum itself is? You can see the soap scum is going away. You can kind of see the difference where there's, I've wiped and where I haven't wiped. You can see it. It's actually getting my shower door clean. I'm not really scrubbing too hard at all. Look at that difference. There's a definite difference. You can see where it's actually drying up there more. I think it's going to work. I think we might get all that soap scum off. Yay! And here I'll wipe right here. Look at that reflection. It's like a mirror. I think these regs might be for the win. Marker on the kitchen table and I'm going to use the kitchen towel. It's coming out. Look at that. Pretty much all gone. Some deep stuck in dirt right here and like the the pores and scratches of the wood. Definitely making a difference. Here's another spot where the pores are stained. Look at that. Those little fibers are getting right down in there into my, my poor worn out table here. It's so sad. But those little fibers are getting down in there and getting those pores out. 